This story is happening in Detroit, in one of the worst parts of Detroit, where unemployment is, you know, 26%, and just drugs and violence and rape and murder. And there is a school there that has hired this music teacher. And this music teacher watched the uh, movie Moneyball with Brad Pitt. And he said, you know, that system makes sense. He said, I bet we could do something and get kids who are in trouble right now. And I bet you we could turn their lives around if we use the Moneyball system. And so he's put together a rap group. And these kids are, I think, anywhere from seven, I think, to teenagers. And they are now, they've put out a, an album uh, that is starting to chart on iTunes. And I want you to hear what these kids are now saying about growing up in Detroit where it's nothing but poverty and drugs. Yeah, here's, here's the report on that. What's it like growing up around here? Yeah. Basically, all it is is drugs and poverty. I mean, every kid has his own decision. Like kids may say, I ended up here just because of the neighborhood I live in. It's your choice whether you want to make it or you don't. Whether you want to be another statistic like down, another drug dealer that they know about, or you can be somebody successful. And I choose to be somebody successful. Highland Park, wow. Michigan, a city just waiting for a comeback. Wow. At 24%, the unemployment rate is more than triple the national average. 42% of the people who live here live below the poverty line. But among the abandoned houses, dope deals, and prostitutes, there's North Point Academy. There's music. And there's Mr. V. You guys... What you can do is you can write the script to your life right now, and all you have to do if you want to have a great story is you just got to stick with it. Joe Versalino is a music teacher at North Point Academy, just 25 years old and taking on the world, joining a music department where most of the kids use trash cans as drums. The equipment is limited, and there aren't enough microphones to go around. Still, Mr. V says he was drawn to the challenge. I felt like it was going to stretch me as a person is going to stretch me and allow me to be really creative. He didn't know what he would create would change the lives of eight young men forever. Brian, Gianni, Anthony, Dwight, Deshaun, Tejion, Keon, and Chris. Together they're beasts of the beat and their first album is setting iTunes on fire. We just some kids from North Point Academy. We know how to, we got awesome talents and um, we, st we just started this group just to put a different type of music out there. My life. Even though these kids have skills, their rap group is not based on talent. They were selected for their personal strengths and weaknesses. Listen to this. A strong leader and a kid who doesn't know his own potential. A kid with integrity and one learning to make better decisions. Mr. V got the idea from the movie Moneyball. Brad Pitt assembled this baseball team just based on their statistics. And like, if each person does what they're supposed to do, then we're going to win. If I feel like I'm about to do something, I don't got no business doing okay, stop. class or... All right, so I, I want you to watch this story, too, on the uh, on the Blaze and see this whole thing. But what I was struck by, a couple of things. One, here's a white teacher in a really horrible area of Detroit doing good things. Hmm, that doesn't seem to fit anybody's agenda, now does it? Here are a bunch of kids that have said, it's a choice. It's a choice. Hmm. That doesn't fit anyone's agenda. Those two things don't fit anybody's agenda, but they are true. And when you watch them, you watch this kid say it's a choice, you know it's true. And it, it just reverberates inside of you when you're watching. Now, the other thing that struck me was when the teacher said he was watching Moneyball and he was looking at the problem that they had, and he says... If everybody just does what they're supposed to do, we win. This is what I've been talking to you about recently. I don't know what you're supposed to do. I don't know what you are born to do. It doesn't take uniting with me or uniting someplace else. It, it doesn't take that. It means stand where you are supposed to stand. Do exactly what you are supposed to do. Don't listen to anybody telling you that you're crazy, that it can't be done. That's what it's going to take. We are Moneyball. Fixing this is impossible, right? We're all the little guys. But if everyone does exactly what they're supposed to do, we win. 
Don't let anybody convince you differently. Don't let anybody tell you differently. There is power in words. There are power in ideas. Real power. The right words lift up. The wrong words destroy you. May I urge that if you have never read As a Man Thinketh, please do. You can read it in less than an hour. You read it in probably 30 minutes. If you really read it, it will change your life. But it is the power of the way you think. It is the power of the words you choose. 